You are now watching a Lucky Penny Shop product feature. Hello and welcome to Lucky Mini Food. Today in the Lucky Mini Kitchen, we're going to be preparing some deviled eggs. And there's your mayonnaise and your yep. Dijon mustard. And some paprika for the top and of course, we can't forget the eggs. Hey, that's a cute bowl. Where'd you get yeah, that? Yeah, my Nono made it. Oh, nice. So have you mm -hmm. made deviled eggs before? Yes, I've made it with my mom. She's taught me how to do it. All right, so get the oven going. Okay. We will come back when the uh, water's boiling and start our eggs. Sure, let's do it. So as you saw, I added some salt. Now I'm gonna put the eggs in. How long are we gonna let these boil? For about five minutes. Okay, good. And I think we're gonna do about four eggs. I think four will fit in there really nice. All right, I will set the timer now. We'll come back in that time. What we'll probably do is probably put them in a nice cold ice bath before we peel them and then we'll uh, show you that next step. Okay, so now I'm going to move them to the ice bath. And then what we'll do is we'll let these come to, uh, you know, a nice handleable temperature and then we'll peel them for you. We'll be right back. All right, time to peel the eggs. Yep. Here so it's go. about five minutes to boil. Oh, I get to do one, huh? Mm -hmm. All right. I remember I've done these eggs in the past. They can be difficult to peel. Oh, there we go. Not that bad. Go and put the peels. Ah, the peel bowl, there. huh? Oops, sorry. It's coming off real easy. This is fun. So we have to peel the four. They're nice and cool, so they've cooled down. Mm -hmm. All right, so we'll come back after we get these done. Maybe we'll check in on the next eggs. Mine's peeling real easy. How's yours? Yeah, this is it's going good. Wow, yeah, I've noticed before with quail eggs, they get uh, they break into really small pieces. Oh, you're already done. Mm -hmm. All right, we'll Thank check you. back. I'm surprised how easily these are to peel. Oops. I know, I think the ice bath really helps when you get them right out. Mm -hmm. Look at that. Came out good. I'll let you finish those. Ooh, that one's having a, that one's struggling. I better get in here. Right when I said it, I know. it starts to struggle. Well, it looks like the yolk was right on that edge, you kind know? Of, yeah, I kind of diffed it a little bit. Well, we'll make do. Nope. Oh, I get the honors of the last one? Yep. All right. Okay, let's move on to the next step. Time to cut the eggs. Mm -hmm. So we decided to boil a few extras just because of our few eggs. It's always good when you're making them to do that, right? Yes, just in case. So we could use the yolk for some extra filling. Ooh, those look good. Yeah, it looks really good. Will it come out? Mm-hmm. I think so. Yep. There you go. Yeah, it usually comes out pretty easy, so. I'll tell you what, I'll take that from you here and I'll put it on the white plate for you. Our little platter. Okay. You hand me that one. Oh. Thank you. All right, so we'll keep going here till we get these all out. And she's got them all cut, we'll keep checking back. And of course the most fun part is mixing it all, mushing it together, right? Mm -hmm. Making the concoction. Yeah. <laughs>
think they only hold one more on the platter. We'll leave the other one as an extra, just okay. in case filler. Sure. All right, so we're all done. She's set there. We're going to come back then and start making our deviled egg filling. Okay, let's do it. All right, it's time to make the filling for the deviled eggs. So we have the yolks here. And mayo and Dijon mustard. I don't use a specific recipe, it's just kind of by taste. Aha, uh -huh. no wonder why they're so good all the time. <laughs> yep. Now I've seen people put relish in these, hot sauce, all different things. Yeah, there's a lot of different ways you can go with it. Okay. So you just mush it all together? Mm-hmm. And then I'll add some salt and pepper. Alright, so when you get that the right consistency, oh, it's not. You want to add more <laughs> mayo, huh? Yes. A little more of everything. Of course, working in mini size, there is an added challenge. Different, yeah. I see you went with a light nail polish today. Is that because of the eggs? Let me yeah. <laughs> hold them up. Okay, so what are they? Spark? Oh, you got little sparkles I did on them. Add some glitter. Okay. Mm -hmm. I hopefully I don't get glitter in my eggs. <laughs> hopefully not. Okay, All right. When she thinks good. it's ready, then yeah, we'll come back and we'll reset up here and get ready to fill our eggs. Do you want to taste a little bit? Here, how about I sure, taste we'll a do. little bit? Let yeah, me get a let it. me get a mini spoon in here, <laughs> and then I'll see if it's okay. Ooh, that's what good. What does it need? It's excellent. All right. We'll come back in and fill up our eggs. Time to fill the eggs. All right. Now, I know people use a piping bag for this, right? Yes. So, can I be of any assistance, or do you think you... If you want to Do you need me at all in this video, or are you going to do this all yourself? You can tweak it if you want. Well, it's looking pretty good the way you're doing it. Yeah, it looks really good. The filling came out great. Let's just say we won't spend too much in presentation because we're going to spend more time in eating. How's that? Mm -hmm. Here, let me hold those up for everybody. Look at that. Have a nice close-up shot. So we just got to... Maybe clean them up a little bit, huh? Yeah, that's okay. We will. And the paprika goes on at the end, huh? Mm-hmm. Looks like you got plenty of filling. We might be able to add a little bit more. Yeah, we Once can top it off. Yeah. Before we head to the table, we'll Clean them all really nice, how's that? Sure. All right, almost done there. We will clean these up, add a little bit more to some of these, and then we'll do our paprika on mm, top. I'm ready. All right, time for a little table side preparation, huh? Yeah. So now you just put a little bit on the top of each one? Mm-hmm, just a little dust. I was saying how nice your uh, filling looks. Yes, and tastes. So you think when you use a piping bag, they probably come out nicer for presentation, huh? Yeah, and you could use different tips and stuff if you want to mix it up. These are purely for eating, everybody. Purely for eating. While you do that, I got the plates set. Okay. I'm sure you're going to try one too, huh? Of course.
we'll have to reset up. I want to give everybody a nice close-up shot when you're done there. Okay. They look good. One more, and then we can start eating? Yes. <laughs> Perfect. Hey, <laughs> at the same time. All right, we'll set this up. We'll give you a close-up shot, and then we're going to give them a taste. All right. All right, time to eat some deviled eggs. Yum, they look great. All right, this is for everybody out there. Okay. Ooh, they're hard to get out. There you go. Ooh, I caught it just in time. <laughs> Ooh, yeah, that one's mine. There you go. Slippery. There you go. Thank you. Look at that, everybody. Up right. close. Ooh, oh, they slide so around. Ooh, I think I'm going to so use good. a fork. All right, here we go. Okay. Our first mini deviled quail eggs, huh? Yep. All right. I'm just going to stab it. Stab it and eat it. Stab it in the side, yeah. Oh, creamy. Good. Mm. That's delicious. Just enough salt, too. Hmm. There's something wrong with this one right here. I think maybe this Better one might be. It. Yeah, this one might be bad. Looks like a dud. Super tasty. Well, I love deviled eggs, and I think this turned out really great. Excellent job. Just like regular size. Yeah. And I'm not sure what we're going to do next time, so we'll surprise you with something different. All right. Until we see you next time. Happy, Happy eating. eating! If you're looking for the item you just saw in the video, click here. Watch more videos by clicking oh. here. Don't forget to share on social media and give a thumbs up. Hey, LPS Dave. What's up, Butch? Make sure they don't forget to subscribe. Oh yeah, please click here to subscribe to Lucky Penny Shop. And always remember when you see a Lucky Penny, pick it up!